Hi. I'm waiting for the camera to fall down again. I put it, Ethan's got this little tripod ring light thing. And it just went, it like bent itself in half. It's a mess. Have you met Linda? We have an unboxing, unbagging. Have you heard of Timu? So I heard about Timu from, uh, what's his name? The guy from James from Freaking Reviews ordered stuff from Timo and got it in like, I don't know, eight days or something like that. Uh, so it says everything, they have like a 71% like 10 day, I don't know. The stuff is coming from China, but for some reason it doesn't take a month. So I watched his video and saw what he ordered and... Um, he was pretty happy with most of it, so I thought, all right, I'm going to give this a try. And the next thing I knew, I had made multiple orders. This is not everything. This is just what's come. So let's start with the little bag. I'm going to have to put my glasses on because I can't see. And I have two dogs who think I have bags of T-R-E-A-T-S, and I don't. There might be... I need the scissors or something. There might be something in here for them, but I don't know for sure. Seriously waiting for that camera to fall again. It's not food. You're very food motivated, I know. Anyway, I ordered the stuff January 6th. This camera moving. Um, and today is the 17th. So, I, it's in a bag that will not open. If I get up, I'm going to knock the camera. I got it. Thank you. Oh, you're going to help too? Everybody's going to help. Okay. So, I placed an order, and that's what I think this other bag is. And then, you've got like 24 hours, really hot, um, to do add-ons. These are my add-ons. They came the same day as my other stuff, but they were packaged separately. So, this is for me. It's not technically Lego. It's Lego-ish. And it's a typewriter. And it was only 20 bucks. And then these are for Ethan. And they're itty-bitty. They're going to go on his shelf. But they're Lego. It's a guitar and a bass that he can put together. Oh, those were so cute. I don't remember how much those were. They were not very much. They're itty bitty. Okay, so that bag's empty. So those were the add-ons. That's what I tacked on to my order. This was my order. And this, I want to say I spent $64. The um, real Lego typewriter, by the way, is like 200 I don't know how many pieces this is. I don't know if this says anything other than made in China that isn't in Chinese. It says the word typewriter. Uh, it's for six years and older. Other than that, it's a mystery item. I have no idea how many pieces. But the people who were reviewing this stuff gave this brand um, pretty good reviews. His little mini electric bass. Man, those pieces are itty bitty. Oh my god, that's adorable. Okay. I'm going to struggle to open this one. I'm trying not to break a nail. Okay. Ugh, got it. Okay, let's see what I bought. Because I don't know. Oh, girls, this is for you. This is for you. I didn't know which order it was going to be in. So I ordered, it is a dog leash. It's pink. And it's got three leads. And they they come off. So now there's, now there's only two leads. So I can, we can walk the dogs with just one hand. I'm just trying to, it's got a little bit of stretch to it, but not much. And that is a very, very padded handle. I like that. Because the two of them pulling at the same time is going to be 
quite the uh, they're, they're gonna knock me down anyway oh god I wish I I should have looked all this stuff up and written down how much it was first none of it was very expensive like I said this entire bag I think was $64 okay what's this I don't know Okay, there's no toys in here. Okay, whatever it is, it... Oh, I know what these are. I know what these are. These dogs are very excited. These are wheels. That you... Um, that's a sticky thing. They're for, like, the bottom of the garbage can. I'm constantly walking into the garbage can and, and hurting myself. And I decided it needed wheels. So it was like, I don't know, two bucks or something. So I'm putting wheels on our garbage can. I didn't say that these were things I needed. I just said these were things I bought. Okay, let's see what else we've got. Ooh, I hope this works. So two jobs ago, my boss had this little, um, little thing. And what it did was you ran it along your windshield wiper and it, uh, it like shaved it and made it, um, sharper. Like it was a windshield wiper sharpener. Got rid of all the little nicks and stuff and, and made it so that it was smoother on your windshield. And supposedly that's what this is. And I have no idea how it works. There was a piece of paper. Oh, there's a picture. And there's a piece of paper in this box with stickers. Why do I need stickers with a windshield wiper repair? So it's a wiper repairer. So we'll have to find out how that works. Ethan has my car right now. I can't do anything. So we have that. Then this one kind of opened and these are all over the place. What are... Oh, okay. So you... There's sticky things, and you put it on there, and you put it on the wall, and you see the shape of that? It's for hanging baseball hats. But don't you think that that would hold mouse ears? We're going to try that. It was, a, it was a set of 16. So we're going to try that to hang some of the mouse ears, because right now we're just using command hooks, and it doesn't always work so great. But, oops. That was, that bag opened in the package. It didn't just open, it exploded and ripped. But that's okay. I'll just keep digging those out as we go. Okay. <gasps> Next is this. What is this? I don't know. It says it's made in China. We already knew that, didn't we? Okay. So far, I'm very happy. So far, I don't see anything real crappy. What is this? Oh! <laughs> this is their little tiny sticks. And they're actually waxing sticks. I don't know what the hell you're waxing with teeny tiny little sticks like this. But I thought these would be really good for, um, like, moisturizer things. I'm sick of getting moisturizer under my nails, basically. So I thought, I'm going to get little sticks. And it was a set of 400, so, you know, they're disposable. It's going to take me a while to get through 400 sticks. So I got that. What's this? This is... Oh, this is... There's actually two of this one. Um, this is a swivel hook that sticks on. There's the stick. And it clips onto that little clip there. And... And it's stuck in this box. There we go. So it's for under your cabinets. You put that on the bottom of your cabinet and then you hook that on. And then those hang and you can put um, utensils. You can hang utensils and stuff from them or dish towel, whatever you want. So I got two of those because I thought it would be nice to have those in different spots. Don't you dare hit that cord, sweetie cakes. So I got those. I'm just making a huge pile in front of me. 
Okay, next up. Oh, this is for my nail art. This is, make sure it's not open before I pull it out of this bag. Okay. These are little bitty pearls. I have no idea if you can see that or not. But they're little tiny half pearls for on my nails. So nail art stuff. That's cool. Bitty bitty pearls. Okay, that's good. Next. What are you? Oh. Don't you love when you order stuff and you have no idea what you ordered. This is for the car. And this goes on here. Somehow. Figure out how that goes on. And this goes on here. It's really backlit from the it goes there. Come on, get in there. There we go. Okay, so it's to clean the windshield. Like down, you know, because it's so hard to reach. It's not for you, but I can't get this on. Wait, 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 I got it. There you go. Uh, my car is not here, but we can clean the inside of my windshield now. Very excited about that. Okay. Oh, I know what this is. I'm like, this is soft. It's not for you. You <laughs> get out of here. The only thing you guys have is, uh, oh, this is not soft. This is just wrapped in soft stuff. This is a water bottle. I thought this was the coolest looking water bottle I had ever seen. Look at that. It's square. Isn't that neat? And it's got, and it's got a handle. And you unscrew that, and that comes up, and you got a straw. We all know I drink more water with a straw. So, it's not, it's not like a hard, it's got some give. So, it's not like a super hard plastic. But I just thought, I've never seen. Oh, that pops the straw up and down. Um, I've never seen a square water bottle. And I thought it was cool, and I liked that color. I thought that was a really pretty blue. All right, we're almost done. No, we're not. What are you? <laughs> Linda's behind me now, like, what are we doing? Uh-oh. I don't know how I'm going to open this one. This one is completely sealed. Uh, I don't want to break a nail. All right, we're going to save you for later, because I don't want to break a nail. We'll keep going. All right, what's this is? Oh, this is a cup cleaning brush. I was excited about this, and Jen's like, I have one of those. So this is to clean water bottles and stuff. So there it cleans the edge. You've got bristles here. And then you got those. And then it spins, and then you have that. So you can get in all those little nooks and crannies that you can't, like that'll do the rim. All those little teeny places I can't get into on all of my water bottles and all of my cups. So I thought that was pretty cool. So I got that. There's only like, I don't know, nine more things. Oh, these are nail foil things to um, to do longer nails, to, to build your nails out. I wanted to try them, and it was like a pack of 100 for two bucks. I got those. What's this? These are nail polish remover pads. They're just... Um, how many are there? Like 400 or something? I don't know. I don't read Chinese nails or Chinese words. Yeah, I think it was like, it was a, it was a lot. I'm not going to count them, but there's a lot of them. So I got that. Oh, and then these are like bullet journal things, but I want to be that person. I want to bullet journal. I want to keep a journal. I can't do it. 
I don't have the patience to set this up. So I saw these and I'm like, that looks like what I want. That's, it's, it's got, you put the week, you got to focus, your goals, your to-do list, habit tracking for the week, and then each day. And it's all set up for you instead of me having to set the week up every week because I'm terrible at that. And it was a pack of two for eight, nine dollars, something like that. Supposedly, the prices on this site change all the time. I have not encountered that yet. More baseball hat hooks laying in the bottom there. Okay, let's do this one. This one is one of those um, bag sealers, resealers. You got to put batteries in it. And then, um, yeah, I'm going to have to figure this one out. It's got a magnet that hangs on your fridge. And you can, I don't know if it cuts or if it just reseals. I'm going to have to figure that out because I can't figure out how you get the batteries in. But again, I have this bright light in my face. So, oh, wait, I just figured it out. Sort of. Looks like it takes two double A's. How do you open this? I don't want to break it. This, it's a secret. Oh, wait. There's instructions on the side. I'll have to read that. All right, so let's keep that with the box because I have to read that. Okay. All right, two more things and then the thing I can't open. Okay, this looks just like the thing I can't open. Did I order two of something? Hang on, I dropped some. I can't let the dog eat my stuff. I wonder if I ordered two or whatever this was. Sure looks like it. Okay, we'll get to those. All right, this one. I'm excited about this one. So this is, oh, that's what smells like plastic. Okay. Whew. Um, this is for the, uh, nail salon and it's for whatever reason it says hand pillow and then it says welcome to my nail salon and then on the hand pillow it says hand pillow welcome to my nail salon so it's to when you're doing your nails to put your hand on so that it's like a comfortable angle and they're up where you can reach them but then it also came with a mat so it was a little set I thought it was cute, and I like that it said welcome to my nail salon, because, you know, it's just me. All right, so let me um, clean some of this up, and then we'll open these last two. I hooked Karen up, and now she, th she thinks she's stuck. <laughs> Poor baby. All right, let's try your new leash on the way to the park, okay? Okay, so far so good. Whoop, oh, wait. Hang on, there's a car coming. Hang on, there's a car coming. Okay, I really like the leash, so I'm going to show you some of these other things a little closer up. So these were the little finger things I was talking about. They are molds, so you can do a fake nail. Hang on. Okay. I can figure out how to open it. Oh, for Pete's sakes. Here we go. So they've got little markings on them. Oh, that's nice. They're all together. Okay. I've got a hundred of them. I'm going to kill one just to show you what it does. So you obviously wouldn't have nail polish on when you did this. Peel off the back. Guess what? I really don't know how to do this. <laughs> uh, this. And get it in there. This is one of those I will probably be watching a video. 
because I have a feeling that that little thing is supposed to do something. I don't know if here's how it's supposed to cut. But anyway, it's going to go on something like this. Not exactly, but something like this. And then as you do the builder gel or the polymer or whatever it is you're using, you can use these numbers and these squares to figure out how long you want the nail to go and build it up like that. They work. Just trust me. I haven't done them, but they'll work. It'll be fine. Maybe I can even save that one. All right, so there's like a hundred of those. Then these were the pads that I was talking about. And they're basically these little square things that I've already got. So let's compare them because this is what I have. It opens like a Kleenex box. That's funny. Okay, so I've had rectangle ones before. They are slightly coarser, a little bit thicker. But basically the same thing. And I, I like these instead of cotton balls for taking off nail polish. So I just, I figured I'd order some more. Uh, oh, these came in here and they were supposed to go. These were supposed to go in the bathroom. These are the little, they're wax sticks. But I thought they'd be really good for getting um, moisturizer out of the container. Because that's something I struggle with it's always getting under my nails and I hate that. So those actually go in the bathroom. I'll move those off to the side. And then these were the little half pearl things that I got. So you see, you can see the backs of some of them are flat. Well, the backs of all of them are flat. But... Just try not to make a mess. So you can take your crystal katana and take some of these off of here, pick them up, and then glue them onto the nails. They're little pearls. Little pearls. See? Every once in a while I want to do some kind of design with pearls, and I'm like, I don't have any pearls. Now I do. Okay. Get back in there. Oh, Lord, where'd it go? Oh, it's on my thumb. Okay. So there. A bunch of different sizes. Why is there one over here? Get back in there. Okay. And then the pillow is so you can do this and then paint. And it just gives you a better base to put your hand on. And like I said, I couldn't resist it when it said, welcome to my nail salon. I thought that was really funny. I love that it says hand pillow. And it comes with a with a mat. I probably won't use the mat. But I will definitely use the pillow. And man, those things smell like plastic. Much nicer than digging my finger in there. It'll get the, it'll get the stuff out of the corners. Very nice. I'm very happy about that purchase. Okay, I got the batteries in here. Man, that was difficult. And then, like an idiot, I pushed that button in, and I burned my finger. Ow, it hurts. So, I can see why people say this thing melts bags, but let's try it. Okay, so I used it. Man, my finger hurts. I used the scissors to cut off the top of where I was at. And let's see if I can do this without burning the house down. Okay, so far, I haven't done it. I, I have, however, popped the battery thing open again. Okay. I can do this. Maybe it'd be better if I rested it on something. Well, this is just as hard as it looks on TV. Is on TV. Hang on, I had to stop because I was running out of. Ah, kind of working. Let's go from this side. I 
think it's a learning curve to figure out how fast, how hard. Because I think I've got it open over here still. I can fix that. And then it sometimes cuts the bag. And I don't know if it's open where I cut it. I think it is. See, it kind of cuts the bag. I think that's a hole. But it's so small, I can't even get my finger in there. Uh, can I see chips? I can. So it is not sealed right here. Now it is. I don't seem to be burning the bag. That's a good sign. My, fun, my finger doesn't think it's so right. Yeah, this is um, this this is a learning curve because I'm pretty sure this bag is open in a bunch of spots. Like over here. Yeah, I can get my finger in, in the corner here. I'll fix it. Oops. Completely cut that. But it's sealed. Maybe it's supposed to cut it. I don't know. No one's ever really explained these to me other than it reseals bags. Except I think I have a hole right here. And I don't know how to fix it because I'm bound, down by the chips. All right, so I'm gonna play with this for a while. Um, I'm gonna put it on the fridge. All right, so I used my brushy thing to clean my new water bottle. Okay, so 16 ounces falls right there. It's above the just above the 500 milliliter mark on this bottle. I don't know if that's right or not. Okay, according to Google, 16 milliliters is 473 ounces so either this bottle is lying to me or the measuring cup is lying to me and the way to figure that out is to weigh the water that's right i'm going that far all right 16 ounces of water weighs two pounds all right pounds okay Oh, wait. No, it doesn't. <laughs> 32 ounces. 32 ounces of water weighs 2 pounds. Never mind. I know better than that. Where are we at? 1.06. 1.04. Oh, that was too much. 98. Oh, okay. Oh, for criminy's sake. Really? Okay, one pound of water, 16.01 ounces. So if we take this water bottle. Oh, I forgot to measure. Now it's just under. Yes, just under. Okay, I'm really overthinking this. We're going to go with like that. I put crystal light in my water, so um, I don't drink plain water. I don't like it. Unless it's really, really cold water and it's really, really hot out. So this is getting crystal light. So I need to know how much water to put in here to be roughly 16 ounces so that my crystal light is the right. Um, my head is saying density, and I know that's not the right word. Okay, there we go. 16 ounces of crystal light. Woohoo! I like it. It's cool. And it's got a good straw. This part's hard. This part is hard plastic. And it bounces in and out when you close it because the very, very bottom is rubber and like sideways. It's really cool. So I really like that. I can do that and. 
pushes it in. I like this bottle. Oh, there's a Karen. Okay, so this is the sharpener for the car wiper blades. And it says it's a double-sided sharpener with fine and coarse settings. Oh, it says something on top. What does it say? Okay, it says rough on this side. Right there. You gonna focus? And it says fine over there. See that word right there? Fine. And rough. So you just run this along the wiper blade. Like you would sharpen a knife. And supposedly that's supposed to do it. It's got a little handle. So you don't drop it, I guess. We'll see. Like I said, my car is not here. So I can't really do anything with it. That was to clean the inside of the windshield, so I will make sure I've got some window cleaner. And I wanted to show you guys these a little bit closer. So I got him the acoustic guitar. Look how itty-bitty these pieces are. Aren't they adorable? Look at that. And I got him the, the electric bass. Look at the tiny pieces. He's going to have so much fun. Let's open up my Lego set and see what those look like. Linda is very curious about this. And I cannot do this with one hand now. But she's convinced there's something amazing in this box. What do you think, Lynn? Not so amazing, huh? Yeah, you lost interest. Look at my keys. Retro typewriter. Life. Good life is always around. That's what the paper's going to say when I'm done. Okay, so just like Lego, it comes in little bag, numbered bag. Okay. And mine are same size. Maybe a little smaller. Hard to tell. What are you chewing on? I have a book. Unlike Lego, this book is not 7,000 pages. Okay. Just like a Lego book. Cool. All right. Well, it looks like this is going to go together in no time. <laughs> oh, there's only three bags. Three bags or three sets of bags? Three sets of bags, because that's two, that's two, that's one. That's on the floor. There's three, there's a one, there's a one. Oh, God, those are tiny. I think they're the same size. I'll have to try it with one. I dropped, She used to go check out the bag I dropped. Oh, look at, and they even give you the tool. Now that's tinier. That's the tool to take the pieces apart, that orange thing. That is definitely tinier than the Lego one. Yeah, these, I think these pieces are smaller. It doesn't matter. Supposedly, they're just, um, they go together, that they snap together really well. So, I'm not going to say they're just like Lego, because we do have a couple of other sets that are not official Lego, and they don't snap together quite as well. But mostly. And you've got access to a lot more designs and a lot cheaper when you do it that way. So, I don't know what time it is. It might be bedtime. I might play with this. I don't know. My car is still not back, so I think I might just sit here and play. <laughs>